Hi, it's Allison McNamara. Welcome back to Fab Sugar TV. For today's DIY, I'm going to teach you how to dip dye your denim. We've been loving all things tie dye since Proenza Schooler's Spring 2010 collection, and today we're doing a new thing called dip dyeing. Basically, it's a mix between a tie dye and an ombre, and it's a really cool way to update a pair of shorts. Here's what you'll need white denim shorts, two RIT dye powders of your choice, rubber gloves, two plastic bins with water, garbage bags, a hot glue gun and glue sticks, and studs. Before you get started, there are two important things. One, make sure you wear clothes that you don't care too much about, you might get dye on you. And two, make sure to cover your area with garbage bags. All right, so let's get started. First, we're gonna pick out the color dye you wanna use. Today I'm gonna do a dark purple and a light blue to really have that ombre effect and kinda have the same color palette. So pick out your shades. Next, we're gonna soak our shorts in water because they actually hold the dye better when they're a little wet. And then wring them out because you don't want too much excess water. So I got my rubber gloves on, now it's time to make our mixtures. Like I said earlier, I'm doing blue and purple. I want darker purple on bottom, light blue on top. Now what that means is I gotta pour the whole thing of powder into this bin for purple, and only half for my blue. You can also read on the back for all the mixing instructions in case you don't use this brand. All right, so here comes the fun part. We're gonna start dyeing. So one thing to remember is you're going to dye the lightest part first. So we're doing the top light, light blue on top. So we're going to dip it in. The thing to remember is don't let it sit and soak in there. Just dip it in and take it right out because it's going to really absorb it fast. Let it drip for a little bit because if you turn it over too fast, it's going to run down the pant. So cool, right? Okay, let's do the bottom. Let's do the purple section. So same thing, just dip it in and then bring it out. I'm actually pretty happy with this color. I'm going to do the bottom, just the very bottom, a little bit darker here. I like this because it's a less expected version of tie-dye. You see so much tie-dye out there, but you don't see a lot of dip dye. Okay, so we've done our dip dyeing, but I think we should push it a little bit further and make it a whole look. So we're gonna add on some studs. Take your glue gun and start gluing. Today I'm gonna do it around the pockets, but you can really do it anywhere. So as you can see, we have our very own pair of dip dye shorts with studs. Very personalized, super cool, and perfect for summer. Now ours are still a little damp, so let them dry overnight before you wear them, but they're basically done. I'm Allison McNamara. I hope you guys enjoyed today's DIY, and make sure to come back here for lots more. Stay